Hey guys, I'm back for another video, and today, I'm gonna talk about some stuff. This is a commentary video, and on a topic that's not about this video, I finally got my room set up. Things are still pretty echoey in here, even with, like, literally 36 different um, sound-absorbent foam pads on the wall, but, uh, yeah. Well, anyway, today, I'm gonna talk about an idea I had recently to make school better. So, if you guys haven't seen it, I uploaded a video quite a while ago about my problems with school as a system. I never liked school, probably never will, but I have a solution for students that are coming in later because as with any policy change, especially in the school system, those changes aren't gonna happen in time for me to see any of them personally, but I think the next generation has something uh, they have the potential for something really good. So, my idea was what if all classes were in chunks? So, we all know the current school system. Basically, the way it works, right, is you got, say, five, six, maybe even seven classes, depending on you're in high school or not. High school, there's like around seven. There's a lot of classes at once. And what you do is there's a period system. So it's like, okay, this first period, you have chemistry or whatever. I don't know. And then a second period, and you have geometry, if we're going into high school terms here. So that's the way it works now. Multiple periods in a day. Homework assigned for all of them. You have to get all the homework done, go into class the next day. Maybe there's a cycling system. That's what my school did. The classes cycled. So it was like your classes kind of... They were different every day, and it was really annoying to predict it, but I guess it was fun because, you know, you're always doing something different every day. But anyway, that's the current school system. I would say it's very stressful because you have to switch gears constantly. It's like, okay, today I have a chemistry lab, and I have to do some geometry work, and there's an essay due at the end of the week, and then maybe there'd be another time when it's like, oh, I have to do a packet for, I don't know, health or something. And you have to do some vocabulary for another class. Like English or something. Oh my god. Okay, blue. <laughs> and then... <clears throat> so that's what we have now. I propose that instead of that, classes were in chunks. Which basically would mean that in the void, it would basically mean that you would have, say, if we're going by college terms here, this is probably the place where it's most likely to happen because colleges are, you know, private, so they don't have to deal with, like, laws and subsidies from the government and stuff like that. So what they would do in this theoretical system of mine is there would be, instead of, you know, uh, four months of classes, taking five classes in a semester or whatever, then instead of that, if you were to spend three weeks doing nothing but one class, it sounds insane and that people are going to get burnt out really quickly, but just hear me out. So literally three weeks straight of the class. Okay, this guy's going to be really annoying, like really annoying. So say I have to take... Uh, calculus, um, computer science, and I don't freaking know. Maybe a psychology class, a writing class. So you would take all of these classes one at a time for multiple weeks in a row. So you would spend maybe three, four days a week going to class for several hours at a time. Uh, so the same amount of time as classes right now, except it would be... Um, all at once so you would not have to shift gears when you're in class because it would just be like okay now that I've um, well, it's like okay yesterday we did um, I don't know, I'm trying to remember calculus yesterday we did derivatives maybe okay no you do not clutch black oh <laughs> that was so good this guy is really annoying. Why do I have to face people like you all the time? Uh, okay. That should do it. 
Oh, he thinks he's all slick with his TNT. You don't even know, bruh. So yeah, I feel like people are gonna say, hey, they'll get burnt out from doing nothing but that one subject the whole time. And are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Nope. Get out. Brings freaking two TNT to a raid. All right. Oh, and down goes his bed. That's beautiful. And he's dead. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha. Payback. Not even payback. Karma is a horrible thing, my friend. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you, Yellow. Well, anyway, <laughs> that's what I propose for the school system, is that it'd be in big chunks. I, I would say it'd be way better, because even if you hate the class, say it's calculus, right? And I, I absolutely hated calculus. But you know what? If I had the option to get rid of calculus completely in three weeks, I would freaking do it. Because instead of spending four months of constantly stressing about exams and like fitting in um, assignments when I have so much work in other classes, it, it's really annoying. And it, it's stressful. It's one of the biggest problems I have at school is stress. And if everything is just in one big chunk, I can focus solely on that class for the whole time. I don't have to worry about any other classes. Also... <laughs> can you like tell me not that can you not tell me to spam the command when it freaking failed the first time come on game no not playing steampunk get out of here so what do you guys think i'm gonna leave a poll in the top right in the uh as a card would you think that taking classes in chunks would be better than having them all at once like the system does it now I think it'd be way better my way because, again, you can focus on one class at a time. Three weeks are up. You take your final exam after the three weeks, and then you move on. Then you take another class after another three weeks. That would be so much simpler. Studying would be easier because, you know, all of the... Because everybody would be taking the same subject for the same amount of time for a very long um, session. It's really hard to put my words together right now because I don't know, I'm out of practice with commentary videos. But yeah. <laughs> oh. I think. No! Mm. Aqua just disconnected. <laughs> Let's see what that poll says. I'm hoping you guys are on my side because I think this would be a great fix for the school system. Let's see what else would make it simpler as well. I think it would make uh, teaching a lot better too because instead of doing the same lecture four or five times in a row in one day, a professor could like do the whole program all at once and focus solely on that group of students and not have to learn several hundred names all at once. They could like really get to know this group of like 30 something people and then they can teach them much more effectively. And then when the term's up, they get to start over again and they can, you know, start fresh and not have to remember a whole new set of kids or a whole large chunk of you know all at once at the beginning of the semester it's crazy because it takes like half the semester from to learn all the names anyway so it's it's just better that way in my opon opinion so better for the students better for the professors probably better for grades because you could study completely for one subject instead of you know having to study for three exams in one day. I I had to do that last semester. My finals were all on one day. It, it was kind of nuts. I mean, I'm glad they're all on one day because I can get the hell out of there, but still. <laughs> that's, that's aside from the point. People don't share that opinion, usually. Also, I think Green's going to want to kill me. Green, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Fine. Get out. <laughs> I don't know why he ran away. I had all... I had so much to lose, and he had, like, practically nothing to lose. Oh, he's behind me. 
No, he's not. That was my Diamond Island. Okay, I'm way too... I am way too uh, panicky today. There we go. Let's just get this armor before I lose it. There you go. Nope. All gone. Can't steal them anymore. And it would work, you know? Like, scheduling is going to be completely different, but it'll be easy. Because it's like, okay, uh, there's this one batch of kids. It could be multiple... Um, actually, no, it'd probably be one group of kids. So it'd be like, all right, you got 30 students for the next three weeks. Or maybe it'd be longer. You know, maybe the teacher would um, work several days out of the week on one group and several days out of the week on another group, you know? <laughs> so then there could be multiple groups. Then they'd cycle out like they normally do. So it, it'd work. Oh, this guy's here. Bye. <laughs> don't you try to run get out of here <laughs> I don't think so uh nobody there so I got to play a lot of bed wars recently I've been uh I, I feel kind of bad I spent seven hours live streaming it a, a day and a half ago I completely screwed up my sleep schedule because if you can imagine I started the live stream at 12 o'clock midnight and I kept going until 7 a.m. Like what? Boing. No. No shenanigans allowed. All that's left is pink. Which I think I should go for from here. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. These potions are making this very easy. Whee! Wee! Oh my god. That was like way too easy. Bye. <laughs> oh my god. And done. This is one of my favorite maps, honestly. Perkernikish. I don't know how to pronounce it still, but it's still a great map. So, why do I think that college is going to be the first thing to implement this? Because it's private, as I said earlier. High schools, I mean, they got to deal with things like the regions and Common Core. And there's just all these regulations and things that are going to prevent any sort of policy changes. So I think the best place for this to at least get tested would be some private college. So like right now I go to RIT, which is a private college. But I don't think RIT specifically is going to do it because I don't, I just don't think they would. I would love if they did. Just imagine getting a whole class done in three weeks. Oh. Instead of it just looming over you for the whole time. Ugh. Just get out of that. Ow. It seems we have a pink man over here. Oh my god. Is this happening again? There was a game on freaking rooftop where this was happening where people kept on. Okay, this is great because now I get to clean. Hello! No. No. Not happening. You know, I'm getting a lot of assistance from like. You know what? He disconnected! <laughs> Yeah, don't mind me, just three final kills, like, 30 seconds into the, into the game. Okay, I don't think that counts as a final kill, though, but still, that's bed broken. But, damn, that was just savage. Anyway, <laughs> oh, boy. Doing the chunk thing, I, I guess to summarize my, my thoughts here, I would just say that it'd be better because you don't have classes looming over you for an extended period of time. You get to get them out of the way, nice and quick. You get to focus only on that class. Don't have to focus on multiple at once. You get to live a little nicer. Maybe you even spend less time in class because, I mean, if you're spending all of your time condensed, then chances are you're going to have a little bit better of a time academically. Like, you're not going to struggle as much for that reason, that you're only focusing on the one class. So instead of switching gears multiple times per day, 
you just do that same thing. And, and as I said, the quality of your education would be better. So the less time spent or like uh, less time spent would equal more outcome. Okay. What was that combo? Let's see. Hi, Blue. How's you going? Oh, you're going for my bed? That's hilarious. I was going for your bed. How about that? We are so similar. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Beep. Is so relaxing, you know. It's just one of the best things for me to do to reduce stress <laughs> by causing stress in others. Now I just got to deal with this one guy that's probably going straight from my bed because this is just how these things happen. All right, yellow. Where are you? There you are. <laughs> So the quality of your education would be better. You'd spend less time. You'd be able to spend, spend more time doing things that you like out of school, which would be nice. Ooh, that was scary. Whee! Whee! <laughs> Bye. That was it for this video, guys. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed. And don't forget to fill out the poll. It's in the cards. Do it. Seriously, do it. I want to see. Let's see how many votes we can get on this thing. I'm going to also post it in the community tab because that's where a lot of people are active with these sort of things. We're going to see how many people think that chunk classes is better than having the current system, which I think is kind of broken. Also, you should click the video in the top right hand corner. Forgot to mention that. In that video, I talk about why I hate school in the first place, which a lot of the reasons that I talked about were addressed in this commentary. So, yeah. Click it. Go.